In our last video, I showed you how to remove the window panes from a window sash. With this window, I've actually already removed the panes. I've actually burned all the paint off on both sides. Now I'm moving over to the repair stage. With these old windows, when you have the joints that come together, this actually has a tenon that pins in. So follow the pencil line a little bit here. It's a tenon that pins in from this rail into this style. This joint has loosened up, as has this joint loosened up. Again, you can see where the, the tenon is here. What I've done is I've drilled a quarter inch hole down into both of the corners, and I'll do the same thing up here at the top where they're bracked a little bit. And I have some dowels that I'm going to apply some glue to. I'll actually then put the glue in, insert these down to the hole, drive them in, they'll overhang a little bit, I'll sand them off, and then that way the window will be back as good as new, no more wrapping. I did not want to use metal fasteners because that's not how you would have done it in the past. In fact, they, many windows that were done in the past, back in the 1700s, 1800s, were actually used, uh, wooden dowels were used as pins in the corners to keep the tenons from loosening up. So that's just the status on how to repair it. So what I'm going to do now is apply some glue, slide it into the hole, and then wait for it to dry. If you like the videos, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. I know the videography is not the best, but um, this is more for me about restoring an old house than it is to produce videos. Talk soon.